Viewers will have access to two forms of digital television from January 2001. After months of lobbying by Australia's media barons, the federal government today announced a compromise. Here's Flo Bitcoin. It promises to be television like you've never seen before. Pictures so bold, our imaginations run wild. Digital TV will let us see pictures that are much crisper and clearer with CD quality sound. But its birth has been blurred by the start between the networks over what kind of digital. Channels 9, 10 and the ABC wanted the best quality, high definition or HD TV. Channel 7 was happy with standard definition SD TV. Today the government announced every station will have to broadcast both plus the current analogue signal. Today marks an important milestone on the road to the new world of digital television. While Channel 7 is pleased, the other commercial networks are not. They say so-called triple casting will mean a slower and more limited introduction of digital TV. But the Consumers Association says it's a win for viewers. Instead of paying up to $10,000 for a new TV, viewers will have options like a converter box for as little as 500 the newspaper giants also lobbied for a slice of the new TV action through data casting. But they won't be allowed to show traditional television programs. They've been limited to providing other information. Interactive home shopping, banking and bill paying. All coming to a TV near you from January the 1st, 2001. Flo Bitcon, National 9 News.